everyone, this is Sarah Lyon here, the 2019 Arnold Classic. I am standing with Brittany Campbell, IFBB Pro League Figure Pro. How are you feeling? I feel really good. Uh, the Arnold is such a great experience for the athletes and the fans, and uh, to be here is an honor. To be invited is super, super special, and making my third trip, I'm, I'm, I'm elated to be here. Yeah. And she beat me to it, third, third time here at the Arnold. We are coming off of our second, so our back-to-back -back win of the Kentucky Pro. How did you transition from the Kentucky Pro into your off season back into prep? What were your focuses this whole time? There was no off season. There so no as a competitor, if you already know what the next show is and your goal is, that's always on your mind. And you don't take a time off from that goal. Sure. So I did Kentucky, I celebrated with my family and friends. I made a trip home to Georgia to visit my family. And then I got back home with my coach Terrence and we got back to work. Knowing that the Arnold was on my plans, the invitations hadn't come out, but we got back to work yeah. ahead of time. Absolutely, you gotta okay. prepare for it because I mean, honestly, by the time that they come out, it's not a solid amount of time for a full prep. Absolutely, and I do believe in working in faith. If you faith it, then you put your work to it. I had faith that I would be invited, and so I got to work, um, I believe about 18 weeks out. Yeah, mm -hmm. I love that. I, 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 I really believe that a lot of the things that you, you know, think and feel, what you put out is kind of what you get. Absolutely, 100%. So now, you already qualified for the Olympia next yeah. year. So are we going to shut it down right away after the Arnold, or are we going to keep competing through the year? I'm going to do the Arnold. That's my only focus right now. But everything that I do from the day that I leave Ohio will be to put me in a good position for September. So we'll kind of strategize, me and my coach Terrence. Uh, but everything is to get me ready for that show. That's the big dance. Sure. And um, if it's competing along the way, we'll do it. If it's not, then it's not, but everything will be in preparation for September. Okay, absolutely. And now, last September, you're coming off of a 10th place finish. Yeah. What is our goal then for the Olympia? Of course, we want to keep moving up in improvements, but is there anything else that you're focusing on to better? Maybe are you changing your suit up a little bit, tan, hair, anything like that? Consistency over time wins. And so the more time that I put in, I find the better I get. And so I'm just excited to see how I can improve between now and September. Um, I've been making a steady climb at the Olympia. And so wherever that puts me, as long as I'm better, I'm proud of that. And you obviously live the lifestyle. You know, you've, you've made a point that it's not an off season. It's just, it's just every single day, right? And you love it. So what is something or what is a tidbit of advice that you might give to someone who's trying to get into the lifestyle or looking to compete, you know, for the first time, or maybe they are competing and they're looking to get that pro card. What's your advice? My advice is to win your small battles every day. And so I live my life kind of by the hour. So for this hour, what is it going to take to make me successful? What do I have to eat? How much water do I have to drink? What do I have to do and not do to be successful? I think when you win your small battles, you look back and that's how you win the war. And so every day matters. And so I'm just winning my small battles every day. And then so a prep goes by and it doesn't seem so bad because it's just one hour at a time. Yeah, mm -hmm. absolutely. Well, and then now we already have prejudging tomorrow. So any any big changes tonight with your with your protocol? No, um, tonight rest is super, super important. So we're at the athletes meeting now. I'll spend a lot of time on my feet, but um, I'll go back, I'll practice my posing, and then from that time it's feet up and rest until pre-judging in the morning. That's the way to do it. Yeah. Rest is magic. Yes. Does the body good. Yes. Absolutely. <laughs> and I recommend that too. And I always tell my clients, like, we work so hard, we work so hard, but take the time to rest. You need a good rest day. Get a massage, soak in Epsom salt, rest the body, let it recover, and right. it'll work for you. Right? Yeah. You're not going to see the results without letting it recover. Yes, that's right. Yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Well, Brittany, we are so excited to see what you bring to the stage Thank tomorrow. You. Looking for that, that top five finish, hopefully, of course. Yeah, absolutely. And hopefully we'll be catching up with you after the show as well. Yeah, I'll actually be shooting with you all at Powerhouse. There you go. Saturday, so I'll see you guys again on Saturday morning. Training video to come. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'll show you how we do it. There you go. <laughs> Until next time, it's Sarah Lyon, Brittany Campbell, we're the 2019 Arnold Classic. We're out.